We start tonight in Door County where a dispatcher got a call she never wanted to hear. An emergency at her home. Local 5's Katie Emron shows us how her family is coping after the tragedy. Just kind of a tragic irony uh, that uh, the person that helps us help people is now the person who needed help. When Marissa Anderson began her shift as a dispatcher in Door County on Friday, she never imagined one of her first calls would be from her 12-year-old son reporting their house was on fire. While Anderson's son and 17-year-old daughter Emma made it out, all of their pets died. My son is really beating himself up. He feels bad that he didn't get the dogs out when he went out of the house. Um, but I'm just reminding him that how much how thankful I am that he's still alive and he's still here with me today. Because had he gone back in the house, it could have ended very differently. The Anderson family is currently staying at a nearby hotel. Anderson says she is still trying to process everything that happened. Feeling very numb, feeling very grateful for all of the calls, texts, messages, donations anything, just the outpouring of support from the community. The cause of the fire is still under investigation. In Forestville, Katie Amrine, Local 5 News. Thank you, Katie. And the Southern Door County School District is collecting donations for the Anderson family. If you wish to donate, you can visit the elementary school from 8 to 4, Monday through Thursday.